My daughter, she's six years old, and she's been a blessing for us. She was born on December 24th. I have a grandma who's approximately 99 or over 100. She won't have been her age, that's okay. And I respect her. <laughs> um, but she's been a blessing for us too, because she was praying for my husband and I to have children. Apparently, according to doctors, we were not able to have kids. But according to God, yes, a blessing was going to come into our lives in His perfect timing. And, um, and she was a blessing. On our 10th wedding anniversary, I found out that I conceived. And it's a girl. And she was born on December 24th. And on the 25th, we were holding our, we were holding our gift. So, um, and also, just to briefly explain, I was experiencing health issues that I wasn't aware of at the time. And uh, she was born anemic, but she heroically did something for her mother. The doctors couldn't explain. She transferred blood to me from her umbilical cord to my body, and it practically did something to save my life. But doctors weren't aware the time was going on. So uh, she was anemic, but she was so strong, and doctors couldn't figure out. You know, just newly born would think you know she would be weak, and she would need a blood transfusion. She amazed the doctor. She was so strong; her blood count went up on its own. No blood transfusion. I was the one who was really experiencing some hard times physically, but it's been a process for me, and you have to take uh, you have to take life's challenge one step at a time, and just trust God. Amen. It's you know, and the scripture that inspires me the most is First John four eighteen. You want to say that one? First John four eighteen. There's no fear love, but perfect love casts out fear. Fear torment, but he who has fear has not been made perfect in love. Amen. So God's love is basically wisdom, and there's something about His love that it not only does it cast out fear, it will make your spirit strong, and you'll be able to overcome the weakness of the flesh as well, and all temptations. So it's just about growing in God's love. Amen.